kids are using um, Lego pieces, cardboard, um, string, and other different types of materials like tape to build a Mars rover, a rover that is going to survive a one-story drop and land on its wheels and also be able to survive the harsh conditions of Mars um, simulated by using a hairdryer. So in addition to the Mars rover, um, they learned about other different or different types of engineering, such as civil engineering. They were building um, bridges and Ferris wheels. They were learning about chemical engineering by testing out different recipes for slime and for oobleck. And they were learning about electrical engineering by building their own flashlights. Mostly the kids are really excited. I mean, they're, these are middle school age kids, so they're really excited to learn, really excited to step out of their comfort zone and do different things. Um, I've seen a really positive reaction from a lot of the kids. If you use the hot glue, you can't hot glue two Lego pieces together. Like you can't, you, yeah, you, but you can't like glue them together for reinforcement. Um, I was an alumni two years, I came to the camp two years in a row, and now that I'm an engineering student at WVU, I'm really excited to be able to be a counselor and be able to help out here. And even if kids like are kind of thinking about doing it and they're not really sure, it's just a great program in order to learn about engineering and to step out of the comfort zone and make new friends.